easily beat the Goblin Delivery Challenge with this deck. This challenge goes up to 12 wins and you have to build a deck using the brand new Evolve Mortar. The Evolve Mortar has a two card cycle and you guys can see that when it fires there's actually a Goblin on top of the boulder allowing you to do a little bit of extra damage. So the best deck for this challenge is here, Hog Earthquake. Everyone is using the Evolve Mortar so the Earthquake is a perfect counter. This is one of the best Hog Mortar decks in the game and my number one tip for this deck is to play it like a Hog Cycle deck. Into a game and we're going to start with an Ice Spirit at the bridge. We're just feeling this guy out seeing what he does. He goes for a defensive mortar so I'm also going to set up a defensive mortar. Doing that just to be annoying it also helps us get to our evolution and then we are going to Mighty Miner at the back. He also Mighty Miners at the back. This could be a mirror matchup. Like I said this is the best deck for the challenge so you are going to face the mirror matchup sometimes. Anyway we are going to pop the ability here. Boom. Doing that just to be annoying. Forces his ability actually and that is really good for me. Musketeer going towards him right now. We are going to put a Hog Rider in front of this and prediction log anything. We don't hit anything but that's okay. We are going to Earthquake here this Mortar and the Tower and we are going to play an Ice Spirit for these goblins. That mortar will get two shots on my tower but that's okay. We still have a damage lead and that's the main thing. I'm actually going to put an offensive mortar up here. See what he does. He goes for a mighty miner. That's okay. And then an earthquake. Yep. So it looks like a mirror matchup. We are going to musketeer in the middle here just to take out that mighty miner. And honestly I'm going to put my very own mighty miner at the bridge. He goes for a fire spirit and a hog rider. So we log and goblins. Super easy defense. We take out his goblins. Musketeer stays alive. We are going to Hog Rider here. Forcing out a defensive earthquake. Going to use the ability just to do a little bit of extra damage. And that is beautiful stuff. Hog Rider on his tower. He has nothing for it. And that is going to eat the entire tower. Beautiful. Oh, the outplays. We are going to put a defensive mortar up. He doesn't have earthquake and I do. So that is super good. Obviously going to earthquake his mortar. Going to play a Musketeer here as well just to help out. And you guys can see the goblins, they're putting in work. Musketeer now tanking for that mortar, beautiful stuff. And honestly, that's going to be a good game. We are just going to keep playing defensive mortars. Only 30 seconds left. He has to do over 2,000 damage. And the secret to winning that mirror matchup is to be more defensive. I waited for him to go aggressive first and then I counter pushed. And just like that, we got 12 and 0 with this deck super easily. Here's the deck once again, if you want to copy it yourself. And if you want to see more gameplay with this deck, I'll put a video above my head.